sometimes in JavaScript, you have an object or an array of objects that you want to kind of print out to the console or maybe write to disk somewhere, right? So in this example, I have Node.js set up. And if I want to write this to a file, I bring in the FS module using this require statement. And then I can write it to a file called out.txt. And I just need to stringify the output so that I can actually convert this object to a string. But one issue that you'll see with this approach is that when you look at this file, everything is going to be on one line. So if you have like a thousand different objects in an array you're trying to print to a file, it's going to look really, really ugly. So one quick little trick you can do is in the stringify method, simply pass null as the second argument and the number of indentations that you want for your object. So if I put four, let me go ahead and rerun this and you'll see that in the out.txt, we now have four spaces in front of every single property. And as your object gets more nested, it's gonna put more spaces. As a quick example, if I say hobbies and I go ahead and say like running and swimming, set it indents properties and arrays with those extra spaces. 